Hey guys, me again with another YouTube video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Colt R75A. This is a another update to the BAR. Like I said in the previous kind of update video of this, uh, we won't be discussing the overall BAR itself. That'll be safe for the BAR video, but we will be discussing the changes that the Colt made. Excuse me to the um, R75A. Um, I will not be going over things that we have already gone over in the previous version of this, the Colt monitor. Um, I don't really know which one came first or whenever you know shit like that happens, but I do know what is different between the R75A and the Colt monitor. So we'll be discussing only what makes this the R75A in this video. So this is what it looks like inside of Studio 2.0 owned by Bricklink. And this is what it looks like inside of LDD. Uh, basically from here um, back is all regular stock other than they changed a couple of the slopes here to accommodate a new pistol grip. That's all basic. They did include this new dust cover on this side which pivots. This is, this is going to be a hard part. So this pivots up like so, kind of somewhere like here-ish. Uh, and then this pivots and covers up the shell ejection port. I've got this section a little too high. We can kind of drop this down a little bit. Uh, but this does work, as you clearly see there. That's cool. So that's uh, one feature that they improved on this one. Um, they and they cut a whole bunch of rings into the barrel here for increased cooling capacity. They removed the big bulky um, barrel swap kind of carry handle deal going on over here and instead replaced it with this smaller one. That's more of just for changing the barrel. Um, because of this system, they needed a way to disconnect the gas uh, system. So they use this funky lever option going on here. I did not make this lever function at all. It's just static and in place. So don't think I can like break it open like uh, you can um, in real life. In terms of grip, this is the same grip that they used on the Colt monitor, except this one actually has grooves cut in it, as you can see here. And it's got a little bit of some uh, like slots cut into the side of it. And then there's also this form of dust cover that flips over and covers the mag well when there is no magazine inserted into the weapon itself. So um, that's everything in terms of changes for the Colt R75A. This is definitely not our last BAR video, by the way. There's plenty of BAR to come. So thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to comment and subscribe for more videos. Some of this one, I'll see you guys later in another YouTube video another time. If you guys want to get in direct contact with me, check out my Discord. If you can't get into the Discord, let me know in the comment section below and I'll send you guys an invite. Thanks for watching. See you later.